Hey, what's up guys, Soldier Knows Best here. So I have the first beta for iOS 13 running on my iPhone XS Max, and one of the most requested features for iOS has been dark mode, and we finally do have it. So I'm just gonna show you how it looks. Now I know some of you Android users already have this running on your phones for quite a while, but it's finally coming over to iOS. And so to turn it on, actually when you first update to iOS 13, it gives you the option to go between the two modes. But if you skip that, all you have to do is go into settings and down to display, and then now you just turn it on just like that. Now there is a quicker way to activate dark mode. You just need to pull down the control center, long press on the brightness bar, and then you'll see a little toggle there to turn dark mode on and off. Now you can also choose to let the phone automatically switch between these two modes depending on the time of the day. So you can hit automatic, and then now you can choose to have a custom schedule. So you can choose to have it like start at 7 a.m. It'll turn into light mode and then it'll turn into dark mode at 10 p.m. Um, or you can just have it automatically go into sunset and sunrise. But again, you can customize that to your personal preference. But anyway, let me go ahead and turn this off and I'm just gonna choose to keep dark mode on here for a little while. And I'm just gonna show you just how it looks. So you see that this is going to be system wide. So all of the um, apps that come already pre-installed on your iPhone, like settings and uh, maybe go into the iTunes store all of these apps are going to automatically be able to switch over to dark mode um, and then developers will be able to um, have the option to turn their apps to be able to allow it to support dark mode as well and so one of the benefits of dark mode is just that i just find that it's a lot easier just to read stuff on the screen instead of having that white background and you can see the colors and sometimes the text just pops out a little bit more and um, and also too it's going to be just better at nighttime so you don't have a bright light in that bright background just kind of blinding you and so your widgets will also have a darker background and i'm gonna switch real quick to light mode to show you just how that looks you can see that doesn't look that bad but you know if you're in a dark room or it's nighttime it's just gonna be a little too bright so I'm gonna turn dark mode back on back on and then you can see it just looks better so especially if you're in a movie theater and you need to check your phone you, you probably have done this before where it just kind of blinded you uh, now dark mode can help you with that as well and so one of the other benefits for dark mode is also that it can help you save on battery life as well um, so Apple didn't really talk about that but that can be a, a benefit of it we'll see if that's the case um, and also you can see with maps it just looks better man I don't know it just looks cooler especially if you have, you probably have your phone sitting on your dash and you're um, using it to navigate um, in your car and nighttime you don't want to have that super bright light now something else that's nifty with dark mode is that there are a few wallpapers that actually change their appearance depending on which mode is activated so once you go into the wallpaper settings you'll see that on some of these wallpapers they actually have them split in half as far as how they will look and also there's a little icon letting you know that these are ones that will work with dark mode and so as you change it throughout the day or if you have it automatically changed your wallpaper will change and then there's an option to allow dark mode to dim your wallpaper so it'll bring that brightness down even more and so these couple things with the wallpapers are pretty nice little tricks and i think i found my favorite wallpaper to use with dark mode i think i'm gonna go with this black and white one so yeah i like these things so yeah this is nothing like groundbreaking you know <laughs> this is not the first time anybody's had uh, dark mode on their phones but it's finally coming to ios and it is a very useful feature that i think a lot of people will get a kick out of so anyway this is our first look at dark mode the first feature i'm going to be covering of the new ios 13 make sure you do subscribe to me on this youtube channel and also hit that notification bell because i have a lot more videos coming out about ios 13 and everything else apple has announced at wwdc so like always leave your comment down below and i want to thank you for watching this video and i will catch you later peace